Hi, welcome to Professional Certifications Channel. Let's break down CPHU exam prep, one topic a day for focused and effective learning. Today's topic is PDSA, Plan Do Study Act. PDSA, Plan Do Study Act. The PDSA cycle, often referred to as the Deming cycle, after W. Edwards Deming who popularized it, is a structured approach for driving quality improvement in processes, products, or services. It offers a repeatable model for continuous improvement by learning from the results of changes made. Definition The PDSA cycle is a systematic series of steps for gaining valuable learning and knowledge for the continual improvement of a product, process, or service. It emphasizes iterative testing and refinement of changes, ensuring that improvements are based on evidence and can be scaled effectively. Details 1. Plan. Problem identification. Recognize an issue or opportunity where improvement is possible. Objective setting. Define clear objectives for what you want to achieve. Data gathering. Collect baseline data to understand the current state. Hypothesis. Predict the outcome of the change based on your objectives. Develop a strategy. Design a detailed plan for how the change will be implemented, including resources, timeline, and key personnel. 2. Do. Pilot test. Implement the proposed change on a small scale, such as a specific department or segment. Documentation. Ensure every step of the implementation is documented for later analysis. Monitoring. Closely monitor the process to ensure it's being followed as planned and to capture any immediate observations or challenges. 3. Study. Data collection. Gather data about the outcomes of the change from the pilot test. Comparison. Compare the data with the baseline to determine the impact of the change. Analysis. Use statistical tools and methods to interpret the results, understanding the significance and implications of the data. Reflection. Discuss the results with stakeholders and gain insights on what worked and what didn't. 4. Act. Scaling. If the change led to an improvement during the pilot test, consider implementing it on a larger scale. Standardization. Update organizational standards or protocols to reflect the successful change. Iterative improvement. If the change did not lead to the desired outcome or if there are additional opportunities for enhancement, refine your approach and run the PDSA cycle again. Feedback loop. Ensure that feedback from the implementation, both positive and negative, is fed back into the planning process for continuous improvement. Conclusion The PDSA cycle is an effective and structured methodology that organizations can employ to ensure continuous improvement. Its iterative nature allows for real-world testing and refinement, ensuring that changes are not only effective but also sustainable in the long run. When applied diligently and consistently, the PDSA cycle can lead to significant advancements in quality and operational efficiency. If you found this content informative, please like, share, and subscribe.